Hi, this is Le from the MathWorks. Today, I'm gonna show you how to trace bus element uh, using highlighting tool. This tool allows you to trace signals across multiple system levels. All the uh, tracing paths will be highlighted, so you can visually observe uh, the source blocks of the target and the destination block of the target. Starting in R2022A, you are able to trace a specific bus element in the model. This can be useful when you try to find out the original block that generates a specific bus element and the destination block where the bus element reaches to. With this example, I'm going to show you how to enable signal highlighting tool and how to trace a bus element signal. To enable the highlighting tool, left click align and select highlight signal to source or highlight signal to destination. You can see the first non virtual block on the path to the source has been highlighted. You can click the icon at the bottom right corner to get more options. For instance, you can press the left keystroke to continue trace to source. In order to trace a specific bus element, we need the help of Signal Hierarchy Viewer. The viewer is able to show the signal structure of the current selected line. If you switch to another line, you can see that the information in the viewer is updated. There are three ways to open the hierarchy viewer. The first option is select a line with right click and then select a signal hierarchy. You should be able to see the signal hierarchy viewer appears. The second option is you can start to highlight signals as you are tracing a regular signal. If the current line contains a bus element, uh, the signal hierarchy viewer will appear automatically. The third option is you can start to trace from a non-bus signal. Then you can do the continue tracing uh, by pressing the left keystroke. As you can see, the tracing continues to the source direction and a hierarchy viewer appears because it detects a bus element. Once the signal hierarchy viewer is on, select a bus element and click the source or destination button. Then the corresponding tracing path will be highlighted. We are aware of some cases where users will create a different bus signal with the same bus element name. In this model, sign and non-sign are different bus signals, but their elements are sharing the same names. Starting in R2022B, you are able to trace bus element even if they are using the same names. Turn on the signal hierarchy viewer. Select the bus signal you need. For example, the pulse from sign. You should be able to find the source and destination blocks of the pulse from sign. Similarly, you can trace pulse from non-sign you can also trace the bus signal itself, including its elements. You can even trace the top level bus signal to source or destination with signal hierarchy viewer. If you want to try bus element tracing and highlighting yourself, download MATLAB R2022 and check out our example.